And back we go. All we need to do is hop aboard and it will whisk us to the summit of the Snouterhorn, where your brother surely awaits. How did he get all the way up there? <coughs> I like that monsters talk, but they talk really weird. What slime is it? I don't think anybody said treasure. The mechanism looks quite older, Mickey. And it explodes. Okay, it's not exploding. Shh, I'm totally not eating some sugar free candy. Don't judge me. We're gonna fight, but I can't talk. From a far off land. It was they who transformed dreams into treasure. Hmm. Oh, hello there. I was just reading the legend behind the treasures found all over these islands. Yes. Then there came two golden dragons. It was they who transformed dreams into treasure. Oh, hello there. No. I've always been curious as to why there are such extraordinary riches to be found here, you see. Perhaps that's why you're here, to search these lands for the treasures of your dreams. Mm. Oh, you're looking for your brother? And he would also have blue hair and blue eyes, as one supposes. As it happens, I do recall seeing such a boy upstairs, though... I was rather preoccupied with my research to pay him much heed. Please do be careful if you intend to search for him, though. The way ahead is positively infested with frightfully uncouth monsters. Best of luck. Who are you? Oh. Let me see. They're rather direct. Let's just say I'm someone who made their way here out of simple curiosity. Look well, Mia, this. you're certainly the prettiest treasure hunter I've ever seen. Now. Well, whoever you may be, we humans must not forget that this land belongs to the monsters who dwell here. We are but visitors. All I know is that this place is full of mysteries, and that's why I'm here, to try and get to the bottom of a few of them. He might be friendly. No, there's no doubt about it. I know a treasure hunter when I see one. I can tell from your eyes. You see, and it seems you have a loyal crew to help you out, too. Kra? Er, thanks? You're most welcome, Grawl, though I'll bet you not patch up my mistress. But that's nothing to be ashamed of. My mistress is in a class of her own, so mind your manners when you speak to her. Oh, shit. Here we go. This place looks and smells like it could be home to monsters. Best to proceed with caution. Murder everything! Kill it all! Oh, damn. Mogsworth just wrecked that dude. That was kind of sad. Nice. We're coming for you, Mugs. Ah, oh, I can break these. Nice. These are probably going to be good for bosses. Ooh, I actually took some damage. I like it. Think you bad boy? All right, let's see if I can break this thing. I might not be able to break it. No, that's too much box for this dagger. Boom, boom, boom. They said he was upstairs, so probably can't go out this door then. 
We'll check it. I can break these. More pellets. A lot of pellets in this game. I mean, I'll take the hill pellets, but... Oh, shit. I keep forgetting I can roll. We need a lock-on button. You drackies ain't nothing! Oh, shit. I spoke too soon, Mr. Drackey. I hope she gets her HP back when she levels. Well, somebody held her. Probably Moggsy, since he's got no freaking MP left. Bro. Calm down. So none of the doors are going to open. I don't like when you swing your dagger because it's got like a lock animation. Like you just can't move while you're doing it. It's just not very fluid for the type of gameplay. Taking a beating. No. No one said treasure, bro. I mean, there might be treasure around here. Is that a man eater or whatever they're called? It's a rather sinister looking construction. It seems to be broken at the moment. Oh, I can't remember what those things are called. It's not a man eater. What the hell are they called? How do I get over there? That pellet. Nothing amazing. But we got it. Hill pellets. I will take it. I will definitely take it. Cannot for the life of me remember what those things are called. It ain't, maybe it ain't man eater. It's something weird. Something definitely with death. Ooh, spiky. I might be good against these guys. Why is Eric in here, though? Your jelly happy? I should pay attention more. There's probably shit up on the ceilings you can knock down too. Now I'm gonna have to pay attention with these pellet things. <sighs> Let's see if the enemies respawn, because I'll totally fight them again. I'd like to hit five before I go on. They did not respawn. Shit. Okay. Can't really grind levels apparently. Something may well be lurking on the other side of this door. Actually, let me. S oh, yeah, it's gonna auto save. Who cares? It is what it is. 
Nice treasure chest. Oh, there's Eric. There's someone on the Look, ground. There's someone on the ground. It must be your brother. Quick, we have to help him. <laughs> what in the name of? Those things are not friend. I can't remember what they're called though. Because it's coming. The hunters? Oh god. Defeated the Heartless Hunter. I was gonna say we better get a level up. Kinda mad they leveled and I didn't hit five. Frighten the life out of me. Well, we made short work of it at least. Now someone needs your help. It could be very well it could very well be your brother. It is my brother. If you knew someone who was good with machines, you might be able to get. Oh, that's kind of cool. My dear boy, are you all right? <clears throat> Eric's not faring so well. Huh? Mia? Where were you? I've been looking everywhere for you. Uh, listen. So we're both looking for each other, huh? And it looks like you made a lot of friends along the way. I'm impressed. You know, when I got sucked through that thing and found myself all alone, I was pretty worried. Never but never mind that. that now. We found each other in the end. What's going on? What am I doing on the floor? What's your name? Porcus and... Deary, deary me, sleeping on the job again, Persola. Come on, up and at him. Hold on. Is this your flapping feline an acquaintance of yours? How dare you! Flapping feline, indeed! I have a name, you know. You may call me Persula. For your information, I have come to this world in search of a very particular treasure. Interesting, very interesting. <laughs> I was a bit freaked out when she started following me around, but Persula is actually pretty cool, and she knows so much neat stuff about treasures and these islands we're on. And now I remember we just got that treasure chest open. When, well, after that, it was a bit of a blink. I'm sure there was something in there, though. Let's go open it. I want my treasure. Well, it's empty now. Who hmm. robbed it? That's very strange. I could have sworn I caught a glimpse of treasure when we opened it. Where's right, the where's treasure? the treasure? Uh oh. Mogsworth? So Silver Bones mangy dog's bloody. Wants to get his filthy paws on the treasure, does he? Well, not on my watch. Hand it over. Curse you, Levanter. No. No servant of Sylphania is going to give me orders. Besides, this chest was empty when we arrived, so stop acting dumb. It must be you who's got your grubby mitts on its contents. Nonsense! We only just got here. Whoever took the treasure, it wasn't us. Which does rather beg the question, who did take it? Oh, there's a third team, I'm guessing. Holy moly. Oh yeah. Definitely a 13. 
Yeah, he looks cool as shit. Wait, that's Bonnie. Ain't that his people? So Gusto? Oh, you dirty little double crossers. Silver. What? Ain't that my peoples? Blast it all, it's silver bones. Well, if it isn't the Sylphanians. A little late to the party once more, I see. We took the liberty of securing the treasure you seem to have been seeking. That that glow, could it be? Yes, no doubt about it. It's one of the seven stones. That's a dragon stone. Oh, bravo, Captain Silverbones. You've done it again. Truly, this is a privilege to see you at work. Enough, Mogsworth. You're embarrassing yourself, and you're embarrassing us all. But, Captain, how can you say such a thing? You call yourself a pirate? That so-called booty you keep bringing back is nothing but worthless rubbish. And look at the ye now, you sniveling wretch. You're unworthy of a place on my thunderous plunderers. You're dead to me. And what are the young ones, Captain? Wow. Ah, the pair of blue-eyed whippersnappers, hmm? Leave. We've got more important matters at hand. Listen up, Silver Bones, you won't get away with this. I will stop you in the name of Sylphania. Levanter. Well, Levanter, it's been a while. It's not often we get to parlay, so here's a little juicy tidbit for you. We've got our sights set on a place called La Isla Dorada. An island where unimaginable riches wait. La Isla Dorada. <laughs> I wouldn't expect a fool like you to understand. Now if you'll excuse yeah, us. Excuse We've us. got places to be and treasure to plunder. <laughs> well, Silver Bones kind of sucks. Just a wee bit. <laughs> Sorry, Mugsworth. I don't think it's for you, bro. Hold on. Do you think it was one of?